Kim Kardashian West. These days, it can be hard keeping up with this Kardashian. It really is such an honor to be here. Kim Kardashian West at the White House promoting her latest passion project, a rideshare program to help former prisoners get to job interviews. These people want to work. They want the best outcome. And I'm so happy to be here today amongst people that want the same thing. It's part of the reality star's promise last year to help get justice for the wrongly accused and to help reform our nation's prisons. To get the president's support and to see it come to fruition was magic. In April, Kardashian revealed she's studying to be a lawyer, hoping to add attorney to her growing list of accomplishments. Last year, she met with President Trump on behalf of Alice Marie Johnson, a woman imprisoned for more than two decades on a nonviolent drug charge. The president commuted Alice's sentence. Kim delivered the news. Alice, you're out. Hoda spoke with the pair on the day they met face to face for the first time. It became this mission that I just didn't want to give up. How do you even begin to say thank you? I was thinking that, like, how? Thank you is not big enough. Since then, Kardashian has been working with the Buried Alive Project, helping to win the release of at least 17 prisoners in the last three months. Last month, she visited Kevin Cooper on San Quentin's notorious death row. Cooper was convicted in 1983 of murdering four people, including two children. Kardashian tweeting, I believe he is innocent. Guys, I am heading to the White House to see. Her latest prison reform push second. juxtaposed with beauty product demos on her social media. The reality star turned entrepreneur turned law student.